This is Ed Baig from USA Today, and I am with Ed Colligan, the CEO of Palm, uh, who has just announced the availability of the Palm Pre. The Palm Pre, absolutely. From, from Sprint or Sprint. Well, it'll come out with Sprint initially. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Now, a lot of people have said, you know, what's Palm been up to, all, you know, for the last year, <laughs> year and a half, whatever, however long it's been. Actually, how long has it been? Well, it depends on what you count. I mean, we've certainly been launching Centros, and, and, and the Trio Pro is a great product that we've launched recently. So we think we've been doing some things. But um, you know, I'd say, in general, the media feels like, oh, geez, come on, we want something really new and innovative. To address those other guys, the BlackBerry, the iPhone, sure. and all the usual suspects. Sure, sure. And this is it. It's a very handsome device. It's got a lovely screen. Yeah. Basically, this whole area is the touch screen. There's the touch screen here, which you can you know, touch on applications and launch them. And those applications come up like normal applications. But there's also, you can see down here, the touch area actually extends below the screen. And, and these down here, you can use these things called gestures, where you literally can move um, your finger back and forth down to the bottom. The reason for that was we really wanted to use this with one hand. If, you, if you've used any of the other touch products, they're generally two hand use devices. This one with the form factor, you can literally navigate around this device and move between applications and do all that and dismiss things and, and, and make phone calls or do whatever you want to do with one hand. And that gesture area allows you to do that. Mm -hmm. Now, there's other things here that's not in that other famous phone. You could do stuff in the background like listen to music while you're doing other things. All the applications, this OS is a new design from the ground up where we started and, and it's, its center point of gravity where it's trying to hit is the web. It's basically not, you know, a lot of the other devices, even Palm devices, they were built around connecting to a desktop computer and getting a lot of information out of it. We built this from the ground up to say we're always going to be connected, we're going to be on the web, and we're going to integrate all that information in a really seamless way. So so all the applications generally have some web component, either location-based or just information you want to draw into it. And the whole design was kind of built, built around that idea. It's not a business phone per se. It's not a consumer phone per se. You kind of want it all, right? We, you know, <laughs> we basically say we think it's the first uh, really phone that will help you manage your entire life, both your work and your play. Um, part of the reason for that is, of course, it has all the play applications like music and video and, 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 and chat and things like that. But it's got in, a full QWERTY keyboard, too, which allows you to really use it for work. I mean, you know, we feel like if you're really doing real text and entering URLs and really you know, doing email on the go, and everything that a full query keyboard is essential. Um, and so we've combined those things into one device that's a great form factor and a beautiful phone. Um, and we've done that uh, in, in a way that we think is really compelling. Great. Well, uh, Ed Colligan, CEO of Palm, I really appreciate your time today. Thank you, Ed. Thank you.